We're joined by Becky Thompson, running as an independent candidate for Green County Clerk. Becky, we're pleased to have you with us. Thank you for having me, and I do want to apologize. I've got a little bit of a summer cold going on, so I hope everybody can understand or hear what I'm saying. Just tell us a little bit about yourself and your background for people who may not know you. Well, I'm Becky Thompson. I'm 39 years old. I reside in the Greystone community with my husband of 14 years, David, and my 13-year-old son, Ryan. And um, for some of you that know Ryan, you probably won't believe this, but he is going to be a freshman this year at Greenville High. And he is the absolute love of my life. Um, Something else about me, uh, back in 1997, I graduated from ETSU with a bachelor's degree in social work. And since then, I've been working in the social service field. We're just a couple weeks away now from the uh, general election. Obviously, running as an independent, you kind of skip past the whole primary process. Um, but now that we're into the into big swing here with the uh, with the general election, um, how challenging has uh, campaigning been for you so far? Well, it's been very challenging because, um, of course, my two candidates have had time to get out there, and and I almost feel as though people have forgotten me, but. Um, that that's starting to, to pick back up and people are starting to remember that, oh, yeah, Becky Thompson is also a candidate. And the support has been overwhelming. And I'm just so thankful for everyone out there. Uh, just talk a little bit about some of the feedback that you've gotten from voters about uh, what their expectations are for the uh, clerk's office. Well, a lot of the people out there would like to continue to see the office um, run um, with with courteous service, the fast service, and the friendly smiles that they've been getting. Um, another thing that we've been hearing a lot of is the changes that my husband has made in the last eight years. They'd like to see those changes continue, and they they really don't want to see that office go back to the way it was before he held the office. That's one of their biggest concerns. They'd like to see it keep moving forward. Some people may question what your motives are for running uh, for the position, uh, especially given the circumstances that that happened in in that office. Um, How would you address uh, the concerns that people may have about your candidacy? Well, um, my position in running was solely a decision that I made on my own. Um, During everything that was going on, uh, I had to sit back and kind of reflect on what that office meant to me and my family and going into it eight years ago it was a family um, decision we ran as a family and we supported each other as a family even though my husband is the one who actually held the position my little boy grew up um, with his father in that office so the office itself was really important to us the staff at the office are important to us because they are in a sense family as well Um, With him having to resign, it really, it it hurt us all. And and I guess at first when I decided to run, it it was kind of a a decision over anger. I was very angry. But then in hindsight and as time went on, I decided to continue to run because I believe in that office. It's been so much a part of us for so long. And I don't want to see all that hard work and dedication lost. I want to be able to continue with that, and I want to be able to continue to do good. And the public has been so gracious to us and our family, and I do want to give that back. Looking back at uh, the campaign so far and and what's to come, uh, what would you consider to be the most rewarding thing that you've uh, experienced so far, just in in taking the process as a whole? The most rewarding thing is is just the, the support from everyone, the love, the prayers. Um, This has really been a time that our family has needed that, and everybody's so gracious and kind, and and it it just it's just overwhelming for us, and we've really appreciated it. Becky Thompson, running as an independent candidate for Green County Clerk, we thank you for your time today. Thank you, Jim.